Personality. Oh, right. <laughs> Not you. Me, Lieutenant Michael. Here I am, Kitty Winks, the world's most intelligent, good looking robot. Ooh, you're terrific. Yeah, fantastic. Oh, how true. What intelligent children. Hi again. Oh, it seems ages since I last saw you. Yeah, two hours. As long as that? Why didn't you write? <laughs> <laughs> that crazy little man in there. If there is, he's a squatter. He'd have been very little. Yes, a squat squatter. <laughs> oh, sorry, Doctor, it's his hotty botty. What? <laughs> it's his hotty oh. botty. <laughs> What has he been complaining of, Mrs. Wilberforce? Oh, the government, Steve's hair, my cooking. No, 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 I meant, I meant, uh, <laughs> are there any symptoms? I mean, has he been dull, listless, washed out? Oh, yes, for years, Doctor. <laughs> Is he in pain? Well, I hope so. Pardon? <laughs> well, I wouldn't have liked to have called you out for nothing. Yes, I see, yes. Uh, uh, yeah. Oh, 98.4. Mm. There you are, Marjorie. I told you I'd got a temperature. Mr. Listen, <laughs> Doctor, you don't have to cover up. I'm a man. I can take it. <laughs> Tell me the worst. The worst? The worst. England are 92 for six. What? <laughs> the test score is the worst for years. But what about me? You're not a batsman, are you? No, but I'm ill. Mr. Wilberforce. Uh, you better look at his tongue, Doctor. Yeah. Do I have to? No. <laughs> you can take my pulse. Oh, yes, yes, pulse, yes. <laughs> I always forget that one. <laughs> Taking his pulse now, Doctor. No, Marjorie, he's checking the time. Good grief, yes. Look, I'm late. See? <laughs> well, what's wrong with me? No, Hayley, Hayley, no, I'm not going. I told you I'm not going honest. Steve, you're scared. Scared? Me? Scared? I look, come off. It's just that, well, it's a waste of time. It's a drag. It's a bomb. It's a downer, you know. You're scared. I'm not scared, Hayley. It's just that, well, you see, I don't need it. You see, because I'm young and I'm fit and I'm good looking. <laughs> well, I'm fit. <laughs> All right, I'm young. Come oh, on. Oh, no, look, Hayley, honest, I'm not going. I'm far too young for that. Other boys your age do it. Other boys my age are just that little bit older than me. Mm. <laughs> please, please, I don't want to go. Please don't make me do it. I don't want to go. Please. Steve, stop it. You're not a little baby. You're a brave little soldier, and you're going to march right out that door. Do I have to be a soldier? Yes. Well, can I be an Italian soldier and do it like this? <laughs> no! Ah! Yes, now this lad does look poorly. Oh, Doc, you're right. You're right. I'm so ill. I'm so ill. Look, I've even got a doctor's certificate to prove it. Look. This is a certificate for a cat's vaccination. That's not the point. <laughs> oh, All this fuss over such a simple thing. What 
simple thing, do you? Dad says he's got to apply for a summer holiday oh, job. Oh, no. Uh, you wait till I tell Isla St. Clair about oh, this. Oh, shut up! <laughs> Can you do magic? Affirmative. Do some for me. I shall check and see if I have any atomic thunderbuster power. Oh, just enough. Watch. <laughs> Clothes, Mickey. <laughs> Sorry. <sighs> They're fascinated by Mickey. Yeah, so let's leave them to it and you come over to my house. What for? Well, you could say hello to my parents. What do I want to say hello to your parents? You won't have to. They're out. Oh. Oh. Not great, Magic Mickey. Oh, intelligent child. I hate you want to see me boogie. I'll oh, blow you boogie. Blow you boogie. No. Stupid kid. <laughs> What's this for? Oh, 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 Mickey, where are you going? I don't know. What? A little smoke. You unlock my automatic over right oh, oh, there, you later. Put your brake on. You put it on, you've got the cable. I have not got the. Ah! Oh, no! Oh, I can't stop, I can't stop. Oh. It's those kids that have done this. I'll strangle them. Where are those kids? What kids? Somebody stop me. Oh, Mickey. Oh, I can't stop. Oh, Mr. Mr. Wilberforce, he's fine. Absolutely fine. Oh, dear, he will be disappointed. Still, I give you a prescription for some harmless but perfectly foul-tasting medicine. Oh, thank you, Doctor. Oh, there is one other thing. Yes? I know you're an expert on bulbs. Yes. And you see, I've got this tulip. No, well, there's no real hope, I'm sorry. <laughs> what should I do? Well, a little water wouldn't hurt, I suppose, oh, but... Uh... I should have called you before. No, no, once they get it, they get it. And this old fella's certainly got it. <laughs> oh, dear. Yes, it's all over. I'm sorry, Mrs Wilberforce. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Never mind. I can always get another one. <laughs> Ah, well, this must be where you come for the interview, Steve. Steve? Steve! Hi there, any jobs for tourists? <laughs> no, fine, I'll be off then. Top. Steve, there's nobody here. This is a waiting room, so come in and wait. Wait? Wait for work? Oh, come off it, Hayley. That's like, that's like joining a queue for the scaffold, isn't it? Oh, don't be silly. You're going to wait here, have your interview and get yourself a holiday job. Job? A job? Job? What a horrible word. Oh, oh look, come off it, Hayley. Look, this isn't my kind of thing. I mean, it's not me, is it? I mean, look at these hands. I mean, there's, there's art in these fingers. There's creativity. Life. There's life in those fingernails, certainly. Give them here. Oh, look, Hayley, look, why have I got to get a job anyway? Tell me that. Oh, don't be silly. That's like saying, why have I got to go to school? Why have I got to go to school? Well, everybody's got to work, even you. Why? Well, because... because you need money. Well, do you reckon that one day you'll get a job, Hayley? Yes, of course. Well, when you do, I'll borrow some off you. <laughs> look, everybody has to work. That's the way things are. Look, somebody made these trousers for me, didn't they? Now, what would I do if there were no tailors working? What would I do if I had no trousers to wear? You'd have a lot of fun on a Saturday night. <laughs> do you want to be an idle layabout for the rest of your life? Yeah. Well, don't you want to make something of yourself? Achieve things? Fulfill your potential? No. Are you a total idiot, then? Pass. I don't know why I'd bother with you. Me neither. Well, I suppose it's my duty. You are family. It's the least I can do. Well, I'm sure if you tried, Hayley, you could do a lot less. Right. That's it. I give up. Steve, you're impossible. You just don't care, do you? I mean, I care and I try and help, but you just don't care. Oh, look, come on, Hayley. Or I try and help, and all you do is laugh and make stupid remarks. And to think you're my favourite member of the family. Oh, Hayley. Well, apart from Mum, of course. Oh, yeah, of course. Gran. Yeah. Mickey. Yeah. Oh, look, all right, come off it, Hayley. <laughs> well, you'll treat me so rotten. All you do is laugh. 
Oh, I've had enough. I'm never going to talk to you again. Never, never, never. Hayley. Hayley. Sis. Pudding features. Oh, you said you were never going to call me that oh, look, again. Come on, Hayley. Look, I don't want to upset you. I don't mean to upset you, all right? I mean, after all, you are my sister. I was aware of that. And I am your brother. Small world. Oh, look, come on, Hayley. I wouldn't do anything to harm you. I mean, I'd do anything for you, anything. Would you really? Oh, come on, you know I would. Yes, I know you would. And I'd do anything for you, too. Oh, would you really? Yes, of course. What, anything? Anything. Next, please. Well, do you think you could go in there and do my interview for me? <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, all right, I'll do it, I'll do it. Hang on. Stop me, Russell, stop me. Look, I can't attack you. Look, Ken, will you do something, please? Look, Janie, will you shut up, please? Huh. Oh, hi. <laughs> You're not helping. Are you? Oh, I wish I hadn't removed this brake cable. Yeah, and I wish I hadn't brought those kids round. I wish I hadn't made Mickey in the first place. I heard that, Russell's. Down? No solar power to go on forever and ever and ever. Amen. Amen. Oh, there's another thing, muscles. What? Want to go to Wee Wee? Oh. oh. Where's he off to now? Oh, he's going for a tour of the garden. Uh oh. What? Mickey, my the. <laughs> Goodbye. Goodbye to everything, everything I've ever known. My house, my friends. Well, my friend. <laughs> my double glazed patio doors. Oh, goodbye, doors. Oh. Feeling better, dear? Marjorie, I heard what the doctor said. Oh, good. Saves me telling you. And I, <laughs> I don't want to cause you any harm. Oh, good. Well, then you can help me with the washing up. Yes, we'll carry on as normal. No, we won't. You can do the washing up. <laughs> oh, Dad, have you seen Mickey? Oh, Ken. Ken is my firstborn child of my oh. loins. There's something I have a duty to tell you. Look, Dad, you've told me the facts of life already. Yeah, and you got some of them wrong. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Never mind. Look, you may have noticed that your daddy is not his normal, cheerful, charming, helpful self, am I? No, you're not. Because oh, you're... Never was. You're good. <laughs> Your daddy's going to, to... Mad robot on the loose. What's going on? I am I'm I'm going going on my double lace patio Round and round the house. Right, he'll get lonely. No, he won't. He's persuaded the lawnmower to go with him. Oh, yes! Buggy, buggy. Buggy, buggy. You know, there is a way he can stop easily. What? It's obvious. What? I don't know why. I didn't think of it before. Janie, if you don't tell me immediately, I'll strangle you. Magic. 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 Yes, he can magic himself yes. to stop. Yes, right. Where is he? Mickey! Mickey! Buddy, buddy. Mickey! Buddy, buddy. Magic buddy, yourself buddy. to stop! I can't. No atomic thunderbuster power. Thunderbusters! Thunderbusters! Thunder don't just stand there saying thunderbusters. Go and get some. Right! Right. Wait a minute. Is your robot. You go and get some thunderbusters. Look, I've got some. Right. I've got some. You've got, got some. some. <laughs> <laughs> 
I'll sort of crouch down in front of him and reverse at the same rate and pop it in his mouth then, yes? Yes. 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 Right. Here he comes. Come on, Ken. Oh, oh, Be careful, Ken. Mind the Goldfish Pond. <laughs> Marjorie. Where are you, Marjorie? Marjorie, where are you? Not here, dear. I've got a headache. Come and sit by me, Marjorie. I won't keep you very oh. long. Oh, good. I oh. want you to dictate something for me. Ready? Yes. This is the last will and testament of me, Wallace Wilberforce. Oh, how do you spell Wallace, dear? W A Marjorie. <laughs> Being of sound mind and body. Oh, shall I leave that bit out, dear? Just write it, Marjorie. I bequeath to my lovely wife, my lovely house. Oh, I thought you'd like that. It's a marvellous house, Marjorie. It's very valuable. <laughs> Almost as valuable as the mortgage. <laughs> and I've done some work on it. I mean, take those double-glazed patio doors. <laughs> People will pay a fortune for those. Mm, I know, you did. <laughs> now, little Haley. I'd like her to have the picture of the horses that hangs in the hall, cos she's always like that. Yes, I think she should have them. After all, she did buy them. They are hers. Oh, <laughs> now, Stephen, what do I want him to have? Um, haircut? <laughs> <laughs> well, <clears throat> now then, Kenneth, who inherited the incredible Wilberforce intelligence. Oh! Dear, I've broken the pencil. Don't hear in me. Then borrow mine, Marjorie. <laughs> now, Kenneth, who inherited the, the incredible Wilberforce intelligence... Oh, dear, I've broken the ballpoint. <laughs> the thing is, Marjorie, I want you to remember me. Oh, I'll remember you, dear. And to help you remember me. All that we've meant to each other in the long, lonely hours ahead. I want you <laughs> to have my wristwatch. Oh, thank you, dear. Oh, wonder how much this will fetch. <laughs> Marjorie! And I thought she'd like that, Teddy, didn't you? <laughs> right. Now, Janie, what are you wearing under that skirt? Ken, don't you think there might be a more appropriate time to discuss that? Oh, look, I need some tights. Ah, right. Haley's will do. Good. Now, just tie one end, one end on here, like that, and one end on here, and I should have a slingshot. Oh, great! Just like David and Goliath. Yeah, right. Yeah, and you're the right size, Lord. Ho, ho. <laughs> Mickey! I'm here, muscle man. Listen, I want you to come back into the house and go up and down the corridor with your head facing into the bedroom and your mouth open, right? OK, anything right. from off. Now, ready, load, aim. Here he comes. Go on, then, shoot. Oh, I can't. Yes, you can, can. Yes, you can. Yes, you can! Right, I'm going to... Now! <laughs> oh, knickers! <laughs> Mine or Haley's? <laughs> there, now, have a little soldier. Look! Mm. There, that make you feel better? Hi, Mum. Hello, dear, you're back. Mm. Where's Stephen? He's about two feet off the ground. Look. Ooh. Guess who's back? It, it's a fact. By your leave, it's super cool, Steve. And I ain't no crumb and I ain't no bum. I'm number one. Hello, Mum. <laughs> Did you get the job? No, he didn't. Oh, well done, dear. <laughs> son, son. What's the score, mine, poor, poor? Your daddy's buzzing away. Right on. So what's with the gruesome 
some Tooser, mate. Mickey's out of control. We can't stop him. We'll try a Thunderbuster Buster. Look, I've tried that, but I just can't get it in his mouth. So what you're saying is you, you want to get the neat sweep in the tin grin. Uh, yeah. That's no problem. It's no problem. Oh, great. Right. Uh, Mickey, where are you? Coming. Well, just go up and down like you did before. You promise I'm not on game for love. Look, show us you can, metal man. Bring it on home, Fuzzy Doe. Bring it on home, Metal Mick. It's a great little say. I'm ready, and I'm in the, my prom. Okay, Stevie, it's countdown time. Five, Five four, four, three, three twice, two, one, one, fire! fire. Mickey, you've stopped. Okay. I'll put you back to normal. Okay, but don't worry. I feel I'd never want to move again. I should spend hours and hours standing motionless. I shall get a job as a counter assistant in Woolworths. <laughs> Mickey, can you still do some more magic? Affirmative, Mother. Well, because this is serious and sad, too. Now, we'd all given up hope. And the doctor said there was no hope of recovery. So if you could just try. Certainly. Oh, yes, and here I am, Mickey. Now, I know you can do it, cos you're so clever and wonderful. Shut uh, up, Father. <laughs> here it is. Oh, now, wait a minute. Here we go. This is it, Marjorie. I shall never rise from this couch again. Never, never. Never, never, never. never. <laughs> Shut up! Air Force Dumblebum, I'm ticklish. Yeah, right at the back behind the odometer. Oh, really? <laughs> Marjorie, why couldn't Roby cure me? Oh, he's got better things to do with his magic, dear. What better things? Um, well, think of something. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I can't see what it is, unless it's that. No. Ah. Oh, no. Oh, oh Janie. I didn't mean to. Well, just stop him. No. Oh, stop me, somebody. No. I shall never walk again. Never, never. Bring him again. Here I come again. Look out. Oh, Mickey. Look, Mickey, want to get the inspection flap open. I must have a place by the old doors. Oh, 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 Thank you.